One local dog owner is in some trouble after her dog bites a young girl, then bites another person while our cameras are rolling. News 8's Josh Scheinblum has the story tonight for us. Josh? And we were trying to get answers for a little girl with cancer who was bitten by a dog yesterday and didn't know who the owner of that dog was. Now, they had contacted police but weren't given much on which to go on. In turn, we went to check things out, and what happened goes without saying we never saw coming. There's a dog biting a young adult in the Short Beach neighborhood in Brantford. It's a popular location for pedestrians and their four-legged friends alike to go for a stroll. The problem, though, with what you see here, this apparently isn't the first time this dog has bitten someone as they walked by. I was like running by the dog. He just bit me. The last incident was on Tuesday afternoon, according to 12-year-old Camden Dunn. She tells News 8, just like the group we saw, she was going for a walk. Until, that is, she passed a woman with red hair and her two dogs. Camden claims the black one came at her without warning and that the owner never checked to see if she was okay. She didn't say anything to me. She just like, told her dog to get down and then pulled him away. Do you think she realized that the dog bit you? Yeah, because she saw it the second time. It's the reason we began covering this story. Camden's mother, Rachel, was trying to get answers to see who owned the dog and find out if it may have had a disease like rabies. At the time we did this interview, she didn't know and had just returned from Connecticut Children's Medical Center in Hartford. Her daughter was given the first round of shots. I was so upset over the fact that someone, a grown-up, wouldn't stop and make sure a little child is okay. Camden and her mother then took us to the spot where it all happened, when in our camera we noticed a woman with two dogs yeah. that appeared to match the description they'd just given us, and she was headed our way. Dog has had all the vaccines. Has all the papers. All seemed to be going fine until a group of young adults walked by. You cannot do that. This time, though, the police were called and a report was made. Does your dog usually bite people? No, no, no. This just happened two days in a row. Sir, it's just that everything was so hectic there, okay, with so many people. And basically, he likes to play with people, and he just jumped, and I don't know what happened. Camden's mother says the shots her daughter was given at CCMC won't interfere with her cancer treatment and that the dog is, in fact, up to date on its shots. As for who the owner of the dog is, neither her or police on scene would give us that information. We also don't know if she was issued a citation. What we can tell you, an animal control officer did come and told the owner to bring the dog to their facilities. For now, we're in the New Haven Newsroom. Josh Schenblum, News 8.